What's up, YouTube? Today's video, we're going to be talking about is Blook it dying and what are the next updates are going to come. But don't forget to sub to my new channel, Repool, where I do cool comic battles and brawls and different animations. So if you love battles and brawls and Marvel and DC villains and characters, don't forget to sub to my new channel, Repool. Link in the description of the video. So check it out. There's just a big popular thing about, you know, why Blook it is dying around this season. And I'm here to tell you this, everyone. We're going to go over this in a second. So definitely check out this video here. A war is near. If you don't know Gim Kit, Blook it's creators. Um, not creators. <laughs> Look, it's uh, basically rival. Just dropped Gim Kit Creative. Where you can make more maps the same time that Blue Kid dropped Tower Defense Crossroads. But in Gim Kit, they're able to make maps in multiplayer mode. So there's stuff happening for the rivals that are really really good and that's drawing away different players definitely check out this video it's talking about contests what is look at doing you know in the meantime and then definitely check out this video too with the look at trading and when it's coming now those three videos are basically on top of look mind because everyone thinks it's dying because look it has to fix the back end of this okay but look it has a lot of competition with gim kit they have to figure out black it and triangulate which basically is taking look it's we'll say code essentially and people are saying where are the dang updates okay book it just did a big ban for hackers they got they're worrying about the back end this is the front end that we see like different unlockables and rewardables but right now people are waiting are we gonna have the coveted game mode if you don't know every year we have a new game mode we were also uh, in, in mayish and we also have a new pack Okay, typically these packs drop in May and then, then Blukit goes into summer. And also Blukit promised that we would get a class pass um, two. So we get two class passes, one for the regular season and maybe two for the off season. Definitely check out the video for that, uh, my interview I did with Ben Stewart, the creator of Blukit. But we haven't got that. We haven't got quests. So people are really upset because they're brokies. I'm not broke. And we're waiting for updates. But clearly Blukit has bigger things to like think about. They have to figure out what their rivals are doing, Gim Kit. They have to basically prepare for the next contest, the, the big, big one. That's where a lot of new new players come in. That's in October. And then trading. Okay, they got to stop the hackers. They got to figure out the community really, really wants trading. I would actually um, compare this to, let me bring this up right here. Not this one. I would compare trading to Gim Kit, Gim Kit's creative making maps. Like this is drawing in a lot of new players. I believe if trading is done well, it's going to draw in an equal amount of um, players coming in. But uh, let me know what you think, everyone. Are we going to get another update in May? We've gotten it every year since Blukid's creation, besides season one, I believe. But let me know in the comments below, man. Do you think they have too much on their plate? Do you think they got to deal with too much competition, too many hackers? They're trying to too many, do too many big things? Or I think Blue Kit's going to pull it off at the end of season four, which is, is coming, everyone, in, in June, essentially. Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks, Just make a video, Grandma.